Yeah, it's a small world after all. Yeah, this right here is offering something, and I am your host, Michael Bernie. You're feeling so good to be alive. You are the most wonderful, that is for sure. Today we are through the roof, y'all. Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> so, how is your social media hobby? Has your hobby turned addiction? Ooh. Why? Social media, social media, social media. You are like a drug. Yeah, an escape. Yeah. Humans around the world are addicted to social media. They wake up in the morning and within the first 30 seconds, cell phone in hand, Checking for their notifications on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, whatever it is, getting right into it. And all of a sudden, before you even had the time to just breathe and love this new day that has been placed before you, it feels like the world is collapsing. Oh boy, what is going on now? Information, problems, hate, anger, distress all flying inside of your mind. Look, y'all, that's not a good, a good way to start your day, and it's not a true representation of the population. The people out there with all the negativity, they're amplified. I want you to take a step back. Make your world smaller. Yeah. Put the device down and look at the world around you. It's very clear that peace develops in stages, in steps. The first step in a peaceful world is finding peace within yourself. <laughs> yeah. This we know. The second step is now finding peace within your home. Yeah, the peace within you. Now, peace in your home. And like this, from the epicenter, that is where peace continues to grow outside of your house, to your neighbors, your neighborhood, your city, your state, your country, the entire world. That's how it goes, right? So for a second, for a day, just pick a day. On Sundays, I'm making my world nice and small. And I'm going to resolve the issues here and create real, effective peace starting from here and expanding around into my world. Put your device down on Sundays, y'all. Yeah! <laughs> You'll see things seem a whole lot more manageable. Yes, yes, yeah. Ah, wait up. Wait. Wait a minute. So people, people, people just believe the news. They take the news as a fact. All right. People still consider mainstream news outlets to be presenting 100% facts. Whoa, boy. Now, I thought this was the people like 60 and older when that's all that was going on as they came up and the younger folk were like, nah, there's so many avenues. I can formulate my whole opinion. But nah, man, people just believe the news. Now, I'm just saying you got to consider, yes, there's truth within many things, but the news is a business, y'all. They're trying to get viewers. That's what's happening. They need a great story, a good pitch, a cutting edge angle, something to stir up your emotions. That's what the news is. Don't forget that. It's a presentation that is there to attract viewers to entertain. The news is just like a sitcom or a movie. 
It lives on viewers. Yeah, so don't forget that. It's not all facts coming from everywhere. I tell you a million times, don't believe everything that I'm telling you. Get out there. Take it on yourself to formulate your own opinions. Develop your own facts from experiences. Don't listen to what everybody says on some mainstream channel and take it as the fact. Open your minds, y'all. <laughs> You're so, so smart. You got this. So, I want to reiterate this right here. Clearly, it's okay to be happy right now. It's okay to be happy right now. Despite what others are saying or the methods that they are choosing to attack you because you are expressing that you're happy at this time, keep on being happy. We know it's okay to put in work to accomplish the same goals, to get at that same matter at hand, whether you're in a bad mood or you're feeling happy. And the reality is, when you feel good on the inside, you increase your efficiency and the likeliness of accomplishing that goal. The people out there that are attacking you for looking like you're in a good mood right now and enjoying your day, these are people that have always been unhappy. They've always been mad they've always seen the problems and right now it's just a little more acceptable to attack people for being happy look at yourself it's okay to be happy trust me there's problems there's struggles there's strifes there's challenges I'm well aware of this but I'm also aware that no matter how I feel emotionally those things still exist so I'm gonna feel good yeah I'm gonna be happy right I'm gonna be laughing and I'm still gonna be putting in the work and I'm still going to accomplish the goal all right feel that for real y'all if you're happy it doesn't mean that you're rude you're heartless you lack compassion, you have no sympathy, you don't care. Nah, man, it does mean you got a whole lot of love and your chances of success in accomplishing those goals are much higher. Yeah, position yourself in a healthy spot. Get it done. So, if you're mad right now and that's your foundation, I'm asking you to cheer up See that it's all right to feel good. Don't let them take over your insides and still work on the same exact goal. Try for me for a day, for two, for three. Let the momentum build, feeling good and getting it done. <laughs> yeah. Remember this. How will you know if you don't try. Yeah, how you ever gonna know if you don't try? Hey man, how you gonna know if you don't try? You're not, that's the answer. You're not gonna know if it would have happened, if it would have worked out if you don't try. So I'm just reminding you again. Yeah, I'm just a little push, a little spark, just reminding you again to jump in. Whatever you think you want to do, that little business idea you got, that new workout, whatever it is, y'all, I'm here to tell you to jump in. This is the time right now, today, this moment. Don't say, no, nah, no, nah, I'm doing it on Friday. I'm starting next Monday. No, start now. Make it happen today, y'all. Jump in, take the risk, push the limits, Make yourself uncom uncomfortable. Yeah, be risky. Come on. Today is the day, y'all. Do it now. Make it happen today. No more procrastination. That is not your style. The time for change is right now. So go on and do it today. Come on. You got it in you. I see it. Yeah, this is the spark. Now set the fire. Uh -huh. Yup, yup, yup. Something music, y'all. I say it every single show. I love music. Yeah, I want to shine some love light on the people over there at the Cheap Seats Ocean 104.7. In particular, Cat Wilson. You got to check out her show.
giving so much love to all the musicians in the New England area, whether they are emerging artists or established artists. Cat Wilson got that good, good rotation on the cheap seats. I love music. She playing that good music. Check it out. The cheap seats. The cheap seats on Ocean 104.7. I love you, Cat Wilson. You're so nice. Oh, you're so sweet. Yeah. All right, now. I'm going to give this big old spotlight of love. Girl. That's what time it is. It's time for the spotlight of love. You thought I was just giving love. I was. Yeah, but I'm giving some more love now. This is that spotlight. Feel it shining. It's so warm. Oh, it feels so warm. This love right here is going out to everybody out there. Every single one of you that throughout the chaos and uncertainty of the last few months has not criticized others for the way they have chosen to deal with the situation. You are so much love. This is love shining on you. Everybody that isn't running your mouth telling everybody else what is wrong with their approach. I love you so much for just understanding that nobody knows and it's not your place to tell people how to live. <laughs> yeah. I love you. Ah, uh, yeah, I do. I do. You want to get a quick laugh? Man! Oh, boy, you got to check out this dude, Mark Rober, and his Squirrel Obstacle Course video. Check it on YouTube, y'all. I'm telling you, you're going to get sucked in, be laughing totally into it. A great, great thing right there, man. So good. Mark Rober, Squirrel Obstacle Course. Laugh it up. It's a good one, that's for sure. Yeah! I've been crushing them cold showers, y'all. I know I've been saying do 30 seconds for a week in ice cold water and then I said now let's make it 60 seconds at the end of every single one of your beautiful comfortable cozy warm showers take that knob make it ice cold and now I'm saying I'm up there hanging out about five minutes yeah yeah not much even of a warm shower just getting right into that icy cold and I realize now doing the breathing around four minutes ice cold water you just feel normal and warm and comfortable and go about your shower like you would in that hot water except you're reaping these epic benefits at the same time you're building your immune system and really I say this all the time too but when you get out of there boy you feel so alive yeah man get in on them cold showers please you gotta try it out yes 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 so the gophers are talking to the rabbits and now the rabbits know that we are the kind of people that save the lives of these little animals after we rescued the gopher from having his head all caught up in the net the other day and the rabbits are just hanging out at my doorstep I'm sitting down like an arm's length away from the little babies just hanging out yeah super super cool oh yeah make sure you are consuming high antioxidant super foods dark greens deep reds blissfully blue fruits get it yes 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 high antioxidant superfoods make sure they're in your diet just do this yeah 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 a couple of things i want you to remember you know I always do this. I am Mr. Broken Record, that's for sure. Let me pound these into your head. You've seen it before here. Remember these things. They're so very valuable in your life. Here they come and throw a few at you. It's okay to be happy. It's all right. Happy is hip. Exercise. Use your body every single day. Sweat it out. Push-ups, jumping jacks, sit-ups. Run, boy! Yeah, give compliments every single time you find yourself in a conversation, whether it's a new person or something. 
somebody you talk to every day. Give a compliment, y'all. A true, genuine, kind compliment. Do that, y'all. Play the game. If you're not failing, y'all, oh, boy, then you're not giving yourself the chance to win. Yeah, you got to play the game of life right. Take chances, y'all. Failing is beautiful. Quitting. Oh, ugly. Yeah. Make new friends. Make new friends. Hear me, right? Make new friends. Oh, boy, you don't got to be stuck to the same circle. Be sure that the people that surround you are bringing you true inspiration. Yeah, it's all right to make new friends, whether you just a wee little one or you like 95 years old. Make new friends. Yeah. Embrace Fear, embrace the fear and build your courage. Yeah. Put yourself in new places, do new things, experience new emotions, do something different today than you did yesterday. Take action, y'all. You are not here to just react to what comes at you. Take action. That is your style. You know, focus on having a plant-based diet and taking care of your body. Put good, clean food into your mouth. Yeah, take care of yourself and laugh. Laugh a lot. <laughs> laugh often, my friends. It's okay to laugh. It is medicine for your soul and your mind. Laugh. <laughs> Yeah, we are live, y'all. That is real. Failure is your friend. Yeah, without him, you won't be winning. Yeah, how would you know? How would you know? <sighs> okay, okay. Let's reel it in a little bit. I really appreciate y'all. Yeah, so, 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 so nice. Yeah. In the coming weeks, we're going to start having live guests right here on the show. Some super, super inspiring, high impact people are going to be on the show. I can't wait for that. Yeah, man. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Offering something is brought to you with support by Enjoy Your Life brand. I love them. Definitely get yourself some gear, y'all. EnjoyYourLifeBrand.com. It's really cool. They got it all, y'all, for your little ones, for you, everybody. So much love to the Higher Education Music and Arts Festival going down in a socially distant style this August 28, 29, and 30. In Lebanon, Maine. Check it out, HigherEducationFest.com. And you know this show is not possible without you. Thank you so much for doing what you do. I love you. I mean that. We are friends. Hit me up. I'm down to hang out, y'all. Send me a message. Yes, yes, yes. Please follow me. Follow my page <laughs> on YouTube. It's Michael Bernier Entertainment. Most importantly... On the rail. Enjoy your life. Yeah. Please do that. Enjoy your day. Enjoy your life. And have a positive impact on this world. Yep. This is Offering Something. And I am your host, Michael Bernier. <laughs> I'm feeling so good, y'all. Yeah. I want you to get out there and do something that makes you uncomfortable. Yeah, why?